hi my darlings and welcome to my channel so today i'll be collaborating with lyric rochester go over to her page and show her some love guys let's get started with the video the link to lyrics video will be down below in the description box hi guys welcome so today i'll be using my beauty creations alicia palette for the second time and so far I'm loving it so let's get started um, okay so I really love the dark colors so I'm going to make this dark blue for it. So guys don't forget to go over to lyric Rochester's video and check out her red lip video okay guys and you can comment and say moya sent you and you can comment what you thought about her video and subscribe This palette is a glitter black. However, I have no problem adding that glitter black underneath the blue. So, in the black. I mean, it's makeup. So, for me, um, there's not much rules in makeup, even though they say um, you can't add a color into the crease um i think whatever goes so i'm gonna add that black not very pigmented So as you can see guys I'm adding that um black right under the blue and I'm just making the same shape because of how I want the eyeshadow to form. Now to cut my crease, I'm using my LA Girl Pro Primer in white character. So it's LA Girl Pro Concealer in white character. 
and I'm going to use that to cut the, the, um, the crease. So now I'm taking the red from the palette and I'll be adding that under the bottom, the bottom part of where I use the, the white concealer. And I'm going to leave a little space above it where I'm going to add my green loose pigment between the black and the red. Now I'm getting um, a brighter red from Red and Black Cosmetics on AliExpress. It's just a single shadow that I bought from Red and Black Cosmetics.
Okay, so now I'll be adding the same red under the bottom of my eye and the green the inner third look and I'll be applying Secret Angel from Glitter Joy on AliExpress. I'll be taking my green, greenish, green, a mix of green and purple button and adding it inside the inner, the inner duct area, which calls the happy area. Mm -hmm. So I just added some under and glitter glue, and now I'll be adding the glitter. So as you can see, I'm being very careful adding that glitter because I don't want it to fall too much onto my face and ruin my face makeup. But um, so far so good. Probably just like a one glitter. You can see, that's beautiful. I can see the glitter under the eyes as well.
blush palette from Miss Doozy and I'm taking the red from the palette and just adding that to the eye points of the cheek so guys don't forget to go over to Lyric Rochester's channel and check out her really video for our collaboration she's Lyric Rochester on YouTube Lyric Rochester on Instagram as well now to bring back some color to my face so it don't look so flat i'm using from my la girl polar palette the shade cappuccino mm -hmm, cappuccino now i'm bringing back some color to my face using my la girl um powder palette i'm just using a uh, cool tone darker shade to um contour and bands up my face yeah so i'm gonna add it in the deep the depth of my cheek above my forehead to make my forehead look a little less high i know i don't have a big forehead because my hair grows out to my eyebrow however <laughs> can kind of look big in pictures you can see i'm doing my um my jawline i don't usually do that but i felt like doing that for this video because i think it kind of looks weird but um that's okay now i'm going in for my amuse cosmetics touch of gold highlighter and guys i bought this highlighter in beauty bogo on clock tower so it's shop number one clock tower and the name of the store is beauty bogo you see that highlight that's beaming gold highlight yeah, i just added it on the above where the blush should be so it's the highest highest point of your cheek and then the cupid's bow down the center of my nose and the tip of my nose as well and um i think i also added a bit of my gvs place highlighter in my fair titty For my lips, I'm going in with my lap lip liner in dark blue, and I'm using that to line the outer part of my lips. And guys, I've been selling custom made jewelry. So if you're in Jamaica and you want custom made jewelry, um, you can DM me at Jamaican Browning underscore Moya on Instagram, or you can um leave me a comment down below and i will reply and we can um converse whether it's via whatsapp instagram or messenger or whatever i'm now using that dark red lipstick i think this lipstick is um thais but the number is rubbed off and i bought it on aliexpress the thais um matte lipsticks on aliexpress they are very good they aren't too drying they aren't like caked up on your lip it, it just feel like you don't have anything on your lip and they're very pigmented i also have a light pink one and i think that's almost finished because of how i use it so much but i also love this one I'm, and i've had it more than a year and it still hasn't dried up and i have used it several times because i really love red especially dark red it's you know it's just it looks it's it just looks classy and sexy so this is 
the end of the look i think oh i'll be adding my lashes off camera and i'll be back this is the finished look guys don't forget to check out rochester's video i hope you enjoyed this tutorial and the old combs here yeah, also added diamonds under my inner tear duct thank you for watching don't forget to like and subscribe